Hi, my name is Staline Honey and welcome to a new video. Today I'm drawing a dark train from The Legend of Zelda Spirit Tracks and I'll continue talking about my YouTube break. Before we start, please make sure you subscribe to my channel and activate the notifications to not miss any future content. In my last video I already told you about several struggles I had with my channel. Today I want to talk about some things which, which happened you might haven't recognized. For example, last year I did not participate Linktober. I made my own Inktober version which I called Hollow Knight Tober. For all who don't know Hollow Knight, it's a really great game and really worth to try out. For Hollow Knight Tober I first prepared my own custom prompt list. It was the first time I was doing this and I was really curious about it. So I collected a lot of ideas. To force people participating, I also created my own hashtag for it. After that, I only needed my own pretty prompt list picture and shared it on Instagram before October started. In the year before, I joined Linktober and set myself the goal to always use a brush for inking to improve my brush inking skills. For last year my goal was to draw digitally because I always wanted to improve my digital inking skills. For drawing I used Autodesk Sketchbook, which was already available for free at that moment. I definitely didn't create the best digital art pictures you've ever seen, but I need to say that I fulfilled my goal. I really improved my digital art a lot, even though these skills are still quite low. But that's okay, I mean, I'm still at the beginning of my digital art journey. If you've missed my Hollow Knight Tober, you can have a look at my Instagram account. If you don't know where to find it, on my YouTube channel directly under the banner picture on the top right, there are the link icons and the first one leads you to Linktree. On Linktree I offer you all important links which include Instagram too. Who followed me on Instagram might know that I also managed to save enough money to buy myself two things I was waiting for a long time. First I bought myself the Astra theme, which I needed for my website. In the past I always had problems to configure the appearance of it as I wanted it to be, because configuration was limited for the free version. Now I can do everything I want. But I have to say that until now I only managed to update a part of it, because it's quite time consuming. The second thing I bought was Clip Studio Paint. This is a very pro popular drawing software, which offers you a lifetime license, which I now finally have. I tried it out a bit and have to say, it's really really cool. Sadly I didn't have much time for it until now, but hopefully in future I have. By the way, would you like to see more digital art videos or not? Until now, I only offer traditional art videos, so I have no clue what you, what you prefer. Please write it into the comments. Another question I have. Did you notice that I've updated the thumbnails of all my drawing videos? Do you like them better now? I hope so, because it was quite a lot of work to do that. As always, if you have any suggestions, critiques, questions or just want to say hi, please leave me a comment. I appreciate comments a lot and always try to read and answer all of them. Now I already talked a lot again and I think it's better to continue on the next video. I hope you all enjoyed the time with me. If yes, make sure to like my video, share it and leave a comment below. Also don't forget to subscribe to my channel and activate the notifications to not miss any future content. I hope to see you on my next video. Bye!